I'm showing you how to get Fabric for Minecraft 1.21. To get that, you want to head over to Fabric's official website right here, fabricmc.net, and this is actually going to be linked down in the description below, together with my Discord server, and I'd greatly appreciate it if you could join that. Anyways, you want to click on this blue Download for Windows button, and the download will automatically start. Now, as you can see in my downloads, I have the Fabric installer. I can double click on that just like so, and it's going to open up. Here under Minecraft version, we want to make sure we have 1.21 selected. If we do, we can simply click on install right over here, and the install will happen right there. As you can see, it's really fast, and this right here is simply the installer, so you don't even need to have this um, to be able to use it. So once you've installed it, you can delete that if you wish to do so. Anyways, now we can simply open up the Minecraft launcher. Anyways, here in the Minecraft launcher, under versions here, you want to make sure that you have the fabric loader for 1.21 selected. If you do, you can click on play. And of course, understand the risks of playing modded Minecraft. Anyways, here as you can see, we've loaded up fabric for 1.21, which is great, and you should be fine using it right now. If you want to know how to add mods for fabric, then press on Windows and R at the same time, and then in a little box that pops up, type in app data, just like that. Hit enter or click on OK, and you should end up in this folder right over here. Then you want to go into the folder called roaming.minecraft. You might need to scroll down a little until you find the mods folder. In here, you can drag any mods you want that work for fabric, and they'll be activated. Now, if you don't actually have a mods folder, then I'll link a fix for that down in the description below. But for right now, thank you ever so much for watching, and I do hope to see you again in the next one. Bye-bye.